because they were visiting a new friend, Maxter. He'd just moved to town from the city and he had something special. Hello, I'm Millie and this is Molly. Well, well, well. We've come to play with Maxter and see his giant television set. You'd best come in then. It was very interesting. Millie and Molly have come to play with you, Maxter. They can watch the TV with me. Oh, gee, thanks, Maxter. We've never seen a television this big before. Yes! Run! Go! Woohoo! Is it true you've got 20 channels? 45. Oh. oh! But it never seems to get off this channel. It only has soccer. We don't mind. Anything else? No. Not even cartoons? Are there any about soccer? I don't think so. He's offside! You can't do that! Well, thank you very much for letting us watch your big television. We might go outside now. OK, bye. Wouldn't you like to come out and play too? Outside? Why? And he never plays outside. He's always inside. Really? No fresh air, no exercise. I thought you said Max to like soccer. He does, but he never plays it, only watches it on TV. On the biggest oh. TV in the whole wide world. That's big. He lived in the city and didn't have a park or anything. Well, he does now. Maybe he needs to learn to play outside. Ah! Marmalade must be hungry. Mum? Dad? Yes, Millie? You want to know how to teach Maxter to play outside. Invite him to the park. Hmm. OK. But can we get a television as big as the one Maxter has? Of course. Really? As soon as you've finished school and high school and university and get a job so you can pay for it. Dad! This ferocious killing machine with its three rows of razor sharp... <laughs> So Millie and Molly invited Maxter to the park. Not too high. They played on the swings and waited for Maxter. <laughs> they played on the roundabout, but still no Maxter. <laughs> they played on the slippery dip. <laughs> but still there was no sign of Maxter. So finally Millie and Molly went to find out if something was wrong. said you'd go to the park and here you are stuck in front of the TV. It's going off. No! Wait! Please! Can we watch cartoons? No television. Please? Outside. You can play in the backyard with your new friends. Get some fresh air and exercise. It'll be fun! Hmm. But no sooner had they all gone outside than Maxter had other plans. But now! But no matter what Maxter's mother said, Maxter always found a way to watch television. Maxter! Hi. This old TV used to belong to my grand, but luckily it still works. I kept it for emergencies. Go! A go! Millie and Molly wondered if Maxter would ever stop watching television. By the time the weekend came, Millie and Molly had a plan. They were going to tempt Baxter outside. No! Keep it to the other man! Oh, this way! Around the back, Molly! Coming! Coming! It's heavy! Oh, oh that shouldn't be a guy! I don't know. 
Find out what those girls were up to. to build their tree hut. And Maxter didn't once think about watching television. Well, well, well. Hey, Mum, look what we made without any help or anything, all by ourselves. This is our tree hut. And these are our curtains. And we even have a lift. Yeah, isn't it great? It's magnificent. Well done. But it's time to get down now. Millie and Molly have to go home. Okay. okay. Coming. But the tree hut was the beginning of a new problem with Maxter. I'm staying up here for dinner. Can you bring me my soccer magazines? Please, Mum? Maxter stayed in the tree hut for the rest of the afternoon. Maxter stayed in the tree hut for dinner. Maxter stayed in the tree hut to sleep. Maxter stayed in the tree hut even when it rained. After a couple of days, Millie and Molly were beginning to wonder whether building the tree hut was a good idea after all. At least Maxter's getting lots of fresh air. But no running around. He really likes being up in that tree hut. Yeah, the same as he really likes watching television. When he does something, he really does it. There has to be a way to get him down. Look out! Oh! Sorry! That's all right, Jack. I've just had an idea. Aren't those soccer posts just behind Max's house? Yeah, you can see the tree hut, so thanks. Jack, will you and Tom do us a favour? on a TV. Jack and Tom are in a team. You can join. Here I come again. Oh, great kick. Actually play? Mum, Mum, Mum! I want to play soccer. There's a team and everything. Can you sign me up, please? Well, well, well. Come on, Look, let's get the board of had won Man of the Match. Well done, Maxter. You were great. I've decided on television. Oh, no. We thought you gave 
not watching television. I did, and I'm going to practice soccer so much that I'll be a soccer star. I'll be on TV instead of watching it. <laughs> well, well, well. Billy and Molly knew that Maxter probably would be a soccer star because when he did something, he really did it. 